Hey everybody, welcome back to Easy Cooking with Gary. Well, I'd like to tell everybody happy Thanksgiving today, and I hope your day is going good so far today. Ours started off real good this morning. We got up early for our annual tradition of our wiregrass turkey trot. It's a 5K run, and we do that every Thanksgiving day since 2013. So now, we're all meeting over at my son's house for Thanksgiving. He's got two big old turkeys on the smoker, and we got the dressing made, and I got the deviled eggs made, and everybody else is bringing something. But I'm gonna show y'all a recipe that we've made this every Thanksgiving from as far back as I can remember. And it is corn souffle, or some people call it cornbread casserole, made with Jiffy cornbread mix. So I am doubling this order. I will show you what the, the single order is, and then I'll put the second order in. Gonna start off with, a can of cream style corn. I've got a can of whole kernel corn that's been drained. Okay, it has two eggs. I'm gonna go ahead and put all four in there since I'm doubling it. It has eight ounces of sour cream, which I'll be using 16 ounces of sour cream since I'm doubling it. And it uses a half a cup of oil, and I got a cup of oil right here, so for a double minute. Go ahead and put the other corn in. All right, let me give this a quick stir here. Jiffy cornbread mix. That's one. Let me give it a stir. Okay, the second. We have made this recipe as far back as I can remember every year for Thanksgiving. And I don't know why we don't make it any other time, but it's usually just on Thanksgiving. I think this is mixed up good. I'm putting, instead of putting it in one big pan, I've got a couple of smaller pans here, and I've already sprayed it with cooking spray. So now, go ahead and pour some in, and I'll split them up. And these are going into a 375 degree oven and they're going to cook for 35 to 45 minutes.
Okay, these have been in there 45 minutes. And I'm not going to cut into them today because we are carrying them over there to my son's house. So I hope everybody enjoyed this little recipe. And I want to say from our family to yours, Happy Thanksgiving. And we're going to see y'all in the next one. We'll see you.